Well, almost feels like coming home, even though I'm not here very often. Oh man. My very first album was recorded with uh, John and, uh, and Black Market Music, so I'm always grateful for that. And I wanted to mark that uh, with a song off that album. It's called The Long Winding Road. tonight, I really appreciate that. Thank you. 
thing you can say if you want your blue. gets worse so I've got my sit list on my phone but I can't read it. I'm trying to read it on the floor. Okay. Cool. Now I know what I'm doing. So I see there's been a bit of a blues challenge going on in uh, Melbourne lately which is good to see that uh, people are going to get to experience uh, everything that the uh, Memphis Blues Challenge has to offer. Um, Thanks to the uh, good advice of a man named John Durr, I actually managed to win the Brisbane one in 2013. Much to their disgust. <laughs> yes, and uh, John said, play, play slowly and play with soul and passion. He goes, everyone's going to be putting the guitar behind their back and playing a million miles now. He goes, Timmy, play slow and with passion and you'll win it. So it was nice to have that belief. Um, I didn't believe it myself and I was very surprised when I won. I was even more surprised when I went over there and saw how it was really done. <laughs> but I did learn a lot and I took it with me. I took what I could and uh, 
fantastic memories and uh, whoever wins and gets to go over there it's something you'll never forget and um, I hope you uh, enjoy it. I hope it's not as cold as it was when I was here. It was like minus 13 and an ice storm and I was like, man, how am I supposed to sing in this shit? <laughs> anyway, you don't want to hear me talk, you want to hear me sing. So here's an old blues standard, this one called You Gotta Move. I'm 
me why You might think you're wrong, baby You're probably right Here yeah, when the law The law gets ready You gotta move <laughs> You might be that woman She working out on the street the car man is trying, trying to keep it. Even the law, the law get ready, you gotta move. You gotta move on, move on. Stand up, you gotta move on. So very kind, Benji, that you guys like in the blues, oh, sorry. Ah, <laughs> uh, well. It's always good, it's always good. It makes me feel happy when I play the blues, that's why I play it, I think it actually helps with my uh, mental issues. A lot. A lot of things help with my mental issues, actually. Blues does help a lot, I must say. We don't want to know about my problems right now, though. Do need is a bit of pair of glasses. Okay, now I've got to say a disclaimer before I play this song. I played at the Blues on Broad Beach a couple of times, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, I never got asked back there again after the uh, director of Blues on Broad Beach had a complaint about this particular song. He was actually quite good about it. He said, oh, I've got to give this, reason, this lady a reason why, how you wrote the song and what it was about. And I said, okay. Okay, well, I took a couple of opioids and fell asleep for like 14 hours and woke up and had this song in my head. And uh, that was really the story. It's not a true story or anything, right? He goes, oh, okay. This one called Better in the Ground. All right. See 
I need her and she order And I'm scared she's six feet below the ground She looks much better in the ground She looks much better in the ground She didn't make a sound when I was pushing her down She looks much better in the ground I used to like to kiss her I don't even miss her much better in the ground. Five long years, she drove me to my tears. She looks much better in the ground. Used to like to kiss her now. I don't even miss her. She looks much better in the ground. Um, I ended up having a funny phone conversation with Dr. John. So um, I was working with Dr. John's uh, musical director on a project, and I ran her to see how she was going with her, what she was supposed to be doing, which is playing some trombone. And uh, she goes, oh, I've got to get into the booth and record this part. Tim, here, talk to Dr. John. So he, she put Dr. John on the phone. He, how you going, man? Yeah, right, yeah, Sarah Slamming, man. That's how this guy talks. He talks how he sings, right? So, um, anyway, yeah, I got to meet him uh, that way. And I know for a fact that he liked that song, so I can die happy. <laughs> Regardless of what that lady thought of it. Do you have a sheet, right? Are you guys having a good night? Yeah! Yeah, cool. So, you know, the reputation of the blues man precedes us sometimes. Uh, sometimes we get in a thing called a dangerous mood, you know? And that's what this song's all about. Spend it all on you. Hey. 
being high in a dangerous mood, man. And I try, I try the best I can. Gotta do the best you can, right? Yeah. Uh, so I ended up in a bit of a food coma, ladies and gentlemen. I got to Melbourne and started eating uh, profusely because of the food. And I ended up in the fetal position last night with a bottle of Gaviscon. Uh, and I was thinking, I've got a show to do tomorrow night. I better bloody get my act together here. Uh, This song's by one of my favourite artists. No, exactly. Um, uh, what else can I say about him? But enjoy the song. You might slip, you might slide, you may stumble and bobble and roll aside.
talk to the Paul. You gotta learn from everyone, cause that's what life is for, baby. To kill ain't nobody, drag the spirit down, yeah. Walk on over here, don't let no one turn you around. And don't you ever let nobody drag your spirit down. Mr. Eric Bibb, um, during COVID I managed to get a couple of little video lessons in with uh, Eric on the Skype. So, uh, I was sitting there with a guitar, looking at a screen. He's sitting there with his guitar, looking at a screen. I'm going, fuck, I'm going to have my leg here. Uh, what shall I ask him? But we are, uh, yeah, man, what a cool dude. What have we got here? This is pretty unprofessional, right? What have we got here? Okay, we've got that one now. Okay, we'll just do that one. Might just catch my breath a little bit. Get a bit excited on those gospel-y songs. Skiddly diddly buddly diddly buddly buddly boo. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, 
If you do a bit of scatting, your wife will love you forever. It's really good for your tongue muscles. Skiddly diddly buddly diddly 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 do do that every day. And she'll love you forever. That's my hot tip. Say shut up, Tim, you pull a shit. You're full of shit. Thank you. Well that was my wife, I think. It's been a pleasure to play for you guys. I've only got time for a couple more. We've got a jam session coming. And we've got um, raffles coming. Come and say hello. I'll be here for a couple more hours. Uh, lovely to play for you all. This is one of my favorite guys too. You guys heard of Kid Mo? Yeah. Well, let's try and do this one, eh? to my sister for coming down and bringing some friends. <laughs> Thanks for the cute to the Cubans for coming down. Yeah, we've got some Cuban cool cats. Oh no, he's not from Cuba, he's from, um, where are you from, bro?
Melvin Mike. Well, that's part of it, isn't it? That's the whole point of a man. <laughs>
Laura. Laura. Mm, well, well, this put me on the spot a bit, isn't it, John? You didn't have a set list for that one, did you? I know what I'm going to play. This song was on my uh, Castle Hill Blues album, which uh, John oversaw the direction of. Um, uh, and it's a little cover of a, of a, of a Bob Dylan song, actually. Um, I really feel like playing this one for you because I really dearly love this song. It's kind of, I've made it kind of bluesy, I guess. <laughs> This one called Don't Think Twice, It's All Right. <laughs> Can we have a big round of applause for Robert Dylan on the sound desk tonight, please? Ain't no use to see the one who I Very much 
Let's talk anyway Don't think twice It's alright It's alright. Thank you.